the baddest men on the planet for a long time, though. The title fight eluded him. Not anymore. Here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, finally making this walk and cracking a smile. He's waited a long time for this. He's not expecting a 25-minute war. He believes he has the power and the skills to get this thing done quickly. I guess we'll find out. significant title in combat sports, no argument from me. Baddest man on the planet, UFC heavyweight champion. There he is in the flesh. What an absolute monster. What a title reign it has been. But a serious challenge in front of him here tonight. When this man became the heavyweight champion, a lot of people thought that this challenger was the one who would wrest the belt away. Now the fight is here. We'll see if we get a new champion or if this man continues one of the greatest heavyweight legacies the Octagon has ever seen. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. So three years the gap in age between these two fighters with big differences in height, but a similar reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of seven wins, five losses. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Presenting. Ready. Ready to fight. All right, so the fight is now underway. We'll see how long it goes. We've got a submission specialist on one side and on the other side. Maybe the most well-rounded fighter in this division. Yeah, he is one of the best fighters in the entire UFC. But in front of him, he has one of the most dangerous fighters across all divisions in the octagon. Because that one skill he has is so good that you're, un you're in danger the entire time. Lee gets caught with that punch. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. That was a cutting leg kick. Big kick land. Oh, tags him with the left. That left hand has been really effective. Good jab. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Oh, body kick attempt here. It's no good. Caught that. No, there's danger in that too because when you start reaching on to catch that kick, here comes the high kick. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Beautiful. Oh, nice job to land a knee to the body. Man, I wish I was that tall. Go for the takedown. Big punch land. Ooh. Just out of range with that right. 
Jacob Hook. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Gall gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. That strike blocked by Gall. Ooh wee, what a right hand by this young man. Pressure and get the takedown now. Nice leg kick. Oh, that's a nice strike. He is all about that left kick to the body. Big leg kick lands. Both guys really throwing with authority. Real sneak body kick. Good series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Beautiful punch. And he caught the kick. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Good job keeping that head off the center line. Slips to avoid the right hand. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Ooh, head kick lands. Perfect. What a punch. Slips. Oh, roundhouse kick. And they separate. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Nice sneaky head kick. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. Ah. You are battering that nose. Oh, there he goes, attacking that dude leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You've got to slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step in getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. Right, we knew this. Don't worry about the cut. We got it under control. All right, now we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides here. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. All right, second round is underway. Your thoughts on what we saw over the first five minutes? I saw a very competitive round and very strategic. Expect these guys to really pick it up as we go forward in this fight. Nice strike. Unable to connect with a right hook. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Out of range with that kick attempt. Just out of range with that left hook. Hands up. Control the face. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Huge block there. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. All right, so he connects with another punch there, kind of targeting that cut, I think. I mean, when you get a cut on your opponent and you see it and it's poured blood, you continue to attack it. Every time you land, you can see that it splits it a little bit more. Great job finding that weakness and really taking advantage of it. Nice loop and punch. Oh, and he lands another 
strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Both fighters throwing heat now. Oh, you can feel the breeze there. Swing and a miss by Lee. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. He is throwing a fast. Oh, the master of the transition. Nice scramble. Good stick. Kick to the body by Gore. Just miss with that right hand. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Goal gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Let's get some offense. Let's get going. What a body kick. And now he's got the tie clinch. Oh, that learned your headache in the morning. Massive uppercut. Ooh, big shot land. Switching stances here. Way to hide that leg kick. Oh, look at him land another jab there. He's certainly using that weapon effectively here tonight. The most effective weapon in all of boxing, in all of combat sports, is a jab. This young man has a knowledge of using it like no one else. Sneaky head kick. Oh! Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, nice right hand. Nicely done there to keep his hands up and block that strike. He's got to protect that cut if he wants to keep the doctor out. He's got to protect the cut, John, but he's also got to be very aware because if he's got a smart opponent, opponent's going to start finding the body now because he knows the hands are really high to try to protect that cut. And they separate. Dig and kick. Calls lower, John, now starting to show signs of swelling. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. There's no give on that leg kick. Lee's attempt there is blocked by the opponent. Right hand on point. Left hand there on the inside. Don't give up. Final seconds. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Ten minutes in the books. All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights. He has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Going to the leg kick now, and it's there. Nice job by Lee. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Tap dance, tap dance. Can't take many of those. You better check. Kick it up. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, 
and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Lee gets caught. Oh, there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is gonna be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. lower jaw is just nasty at this point. Really swollen in that area now. Nice leg kick land. Nice head kick. Right there from the bottom, nicely done by Gar. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. We have crossed the midpoint of this one. Big kick land. Oh, big knee to the body, that'll soften him up. when that leg kick's coming. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Effective strike there by Gold. Right hand upstairs. Oh, big stick up top, that's another one. Well, with that right hand, it's no good. Big right hook coming, it's blocked. Oh, and he just keeps on coming with these shots to the liver, looking to buckle him once again. Buckled him earlier in the fight, and the fighter is still open to damage there as he continues to target that sensitive area. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. tie there and he connects there with a punch so pretty good striking display by him thus far he throws everything so straight and so accurate jab by him there, and that's going to give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. Lee gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can rally. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. All right, three rounds down, potentially two more to go. We are heading to the championship round. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting over and over to the head Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. Okay. It's nothing. It's nothing. You've been knocked down before. You can pull this one out. All right, here we go. The tension is palpable. Fourth round is underway. You've got a thing or two to say about these championship rounds. The fourth round is easily the hardest round in fighting. You're so used to fighting up to three. You got to get back off of that stool. And this is a real test of your will and desire to win a fight. Nice kick. Oh, 
Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Lee's kick to the body is blocked. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. He does everything so well, and he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. Just misses there with the left. That was Smith, the injury. Nice strike. Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many. Back with that offering, DC, he is hurt. What a beautiful uppercut. It landed beautifully. Perfect placement on that shot. Oh, man. Jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did because I have time where I've been kicked like that. And I'm gonna tell you one thing: it does not feel good. Beautiful body kick. All right, so he continues to land that jab. His opponent said he was ready for it, but it doesn't appear to be. You're not ready until you're in there. You can watch all the film you want. You can spar as much as you want, but until you feel a guy with a fast jab like this, you don't understand the precision of that punch. Nice punch lands over the top. Real quick leg kick. A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. Big lip kick lands under the elbow. Counter punch is good by goal. Oh, big head kick. Swing and a miss by goal. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're going to sit there at the drive... I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he doesn't know where he is. He's hurt real bad. That punch landed in the perfect spot. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Just missed with the left there. There's no tell on that leg kick. A swing and a miss by Gall. Oh, and he caught the kick. Big head kick lands. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, nice punch there by Gall. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. And they separate. Leg kick. Misses with that punch. Big head kick lands. Right hook to the head blocked. She got the turtle in that kick. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. You gotta check these low leg kicks. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Got him whip his hip into that kick. 20 seconds left. Right on the button. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Single collar tie now. Great punch. Just misses with the left hook. Let's now look back at some of the action from that round. He went headhunting, landed, 
nearly got the finish, too. A lot of coaches tell you don't headhunt. In this case, he's been headhunting, and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. So here it is, folks, fifth and final round. That's a big strike right there. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time, this guy's making sure nothing lands. Big kick lands. Oh, tags him with that uppercut. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Great punch. What does he follow that uppercut with next time? He lands it so effective. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. That shot blocked by Gore. Ooh, what a punch. Big leg kick land. Nice slip and counter there by Gore. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Lee's got a pretty deep bruise now starting to appear on the right side of his body. His opponent has done a lot of work in that region tonight. Punch over the top. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Lands. Shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Big body kill lands. Effective strike there by Gold. Big roundhouse now just misses. Beautiful body kick lands right under the elbow. Oh, big left hand there. Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Under two minutes remain in the fight. Good punch land. Ball gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. And just like that, the fight is over. Holy smokes! A near-perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week, played out here on fight night, he found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win. So on the sport's biggest stage, he comes up large. The baddest man on the planet, the UFC heavyweight champion of the world, your winner and by knockout here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Gaines will stop in this contest at three minutes, 36 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world.
So we got a new UFC heavyweight champion and potentially a star is born tonight, DC. He is the type of guy that makes people want to tune in. He is the type of guy that you know excitement will happen when you watch him. And tonight he becomes a star in a massive draw for the UFC.